All right, so yeah, let's dig into some Peglin. Like I said, this is an early, like, still kind of demo in progress version of the game. So there are some some aspects that are a little rough around the edges. Just like I have a feeling they might like polish some of this layout stuff up, uh, or some of the sprites up here because like the animation for like the little goblin character is so good. But like I said, basically we're just playing Peggle here or Pachinko. Uh, if you happen to not be familiar with Peggle, and there's a few different like stone varieties or like ball varieties. This is a stone here. And then you can see like the number kind of racks up. So I did like 24 damage. Um, I'm playing with a controller, but obviously you can play with a mouse and then you can like cycle through which enemies you want to target. Um, there's a few, like right now I have the spear. So this is very weak regular unless I hit a critical. And obviously I think I'm going to be able to do that. Otherwise I can like pop into my menu and swap out which ball I want to use. Um, and then the green uh, like R is like a reset. And then the bombs are obviously just bombs. Um, and yeah, 56 damage will take care of that Slimer. And they just kind of like uh, inch their way along. And yeah, I really like uh, the just overall animation. So yeah, this R will like reset. Uh, it'll be randomly, like it'll randomize what, uh, like it doesn't respawn everything in the same spot. Like the critical, you know, orbs or whatever will be in different spots. Um, but I really like the music and I just really like it just again like with this you know new kind of like fad or whatever you want to call it of the roguelike genre i really love how people are like kind of taking spins oh man i'm fucked um oh i got a ton of health though um okay so let's go for the critical over here and see what happens um but yeah i just feel like it's kind of, i don't know it's just like such a new tweak on like I don't know, the ar the roguelike genre, or whatever you want to call it, has kind of, like, brought arcade games back to life, in my opinion. Like, it really kind of recreates that, like, uh, let me pump one more quarter into the I say I say this all the time, so I'm a broken record, but, you know, it recreates that feeling of, like, let me pump one more quarter into the machine, and obviously uh, something like Pachinko or uh, Peggle or something like that is, like, absolutely perfect. And, yeah, I'm getting my ass kicked here, although, again, it's not doing too much damage, thankfully, but... Yeah, it's such a great concept, and it's like, I don't want to, like, diminish it, just be like, oh, roguelike plus peggle, because obviously they had to figure out how this battle system works and how the targeting system works, like, it's, um, and again, they're still working on it uh, at the moment, but I just really uh, like what they got going on here. Everything plays super smooth. It's got full controller support, like I said at the top, which I love. Man, I'm playing like an asshole, though. Um, I really got to kill these things. Okay. Um... I had way better luck on the earlier runs that I was doing. Yeah, hopefully these bombs will do some damage for me. The bombs do damage to everybody, so. Okay. So what do I want to do here? Let's see where this takes me. Yeah, listen to that music. Okay, got another bomb. Or no, I think you got to hit the bombs a few times to set them off if i'm not mistaken because yeah you can tell that one's like lit the fuse is lit there we go yeah you gotta pop them there we go look at that damage when it, now now that i only need to do like four points of damage i get it okay nice so we get new uh up so i only took 25 points of damage there so which i could heal almost all of that right now but let's get uh Applies to blind or refresh the board every time seven are hit. That's actually pretty nice. Downgrades each thing it hits. Yeah, let's go with this here. Thanks, Fletch. And then, yeah, you actually even have to, uh, like, shoot. Okay, do I want to go towards this one here with the enemy or do I want to go so you can kind of... I think you can pull up the map, too, at any point. Yeah, so I can decide, okay, yeah, I want to take out another enemy here. Let's just fire myself right down the path. If you go down that, like, flaming, like, hellhole, if you want <laughs> if you want to call it that, down the middle. Um, if you go down there, it kind of uh, depletes, or it, you just lose some health. Um, I was going to say it depletes all your energy, but no, yeah, you just lose some health. Um, and, yeah, some of the different, like, uh, stones and stuff that you get, like, bounce differently off of the... Uh, Yeah, they have, like, a different, like, gravity or different, uh, whatever. Why can't I think? I can't find any of the words right now. I'm sipping on my coffee still mid-afternoon. Um, oh, yeah, hit that. Hit that critical, baby. Double down. Okay. 
Okay, so take care of that slime. And I like how you can see on the side, like, okay, this is who's coming along. Almost like Tetris style, where you can see, like, what enemies are coming uh, down the pipeline. There we go. Critical. Knock them out. There we go. So it's interesting. Yeah, I gotta be... I, I gotta be a little more strategic with my moves here, I think. So let's hit this here. Because, like, here, yeah, this would be, like, a big waste. Well, actually, I would have just killed that enemy, but... Oh, wait! Hmm. I guess I can't target that particular enemy. And then, also, you can use the D-pad, by the way, to, like, kind of inch the aiming along. It's, like, so minuscule. Um, so what does this do? Refresh the board every time seven are hit. Okay, which doesn't really matter that much because I can easily just refresh the board on my own. But yeah, let's just critical this up. Well, <laughs> whole lot of no good. Pathetic there. Okay, reload the board. Let's go ahead and refresh here. Yeah, this thing's got a little more weight to it, it feels. Oh yeah, this is what I needed. Uh, I wish I could, like, change who I, I tried to, like, hit the, use the shoulder buttons to, like, switch who you're targeting. I was like, oh, so the way that, yeah, the way that keeps refreshing, uh, on this particular stage anyways, especially, the way you can, like, roll around. Okay, so what I want to do here, I think, is, let me put the dagger. Oh, this is just to look at them. Okay, so you can't change what order you fire them off in. I was thinking you could, like, switch up what you've got in the holster. Oh, come on, I just missed that by a split second. Or by a hair, I should say. Okay, so let's go for... I'm just going to see what happens here. Just kind of hoping to get a little something better, but exactly 20 i'll take it one more enemy left so hopefully ah shit okay cool i was like hope i can hit this refresh here oh don't mind if i do yes that was big big boulder baby okay now we got the dagger easy critical oh it's so it does seven for everything it touches oh get out of town get out of town how much damage can we do 200 yeah, let's go. I don't know why it matters, but 203, speaking of big damage, baby. Oh, yeah, this game rocks. Um, let's see. It deals no damage, heals you. Okay. Applies rubber slime. Oh, okay. And are extra bouncy and durable. I think I'm into this. The Splatorb. Let's go. <laughs> Totally, Fletch. That's gotta hurt. Um, let's see. What do I want to go? Question mark or more enemies? Let's see what the map looks like. God, that bass line is so sick. The music is so good in this. And I really love... Like, I do hope they clean up this, like, world map a little bit. Oh, Charlotte's Web. Um... Oh, weird. I'm, like, shooting from, like, in the middle of it. Uh... Let's just see what happens. Oh, I'm all about that rubber... Rubber slime, baby. Take him down. Yeah, this is awesome. I'm really enjoying this, Dylan, for sure. Seems like a perfect, like, roguelike style game. And even in the demo, I know, I've know i already noticed, like, it definitely saves your progress. Like, when I picked up a run earlier, I was like, do you want to pick up where you left off? So, like, you know, if a run happens to be... There are some roguelikes where I'm like, oh, God, this run is lasting for fucking ever. Um, so if the... I don't know how long the runs go, but if they are super long, you can just save your progress and pick up where you left off. And it's not going to be a game where you're like, wait, what was I doing again? Um, it's obviously pretty, pretty straightforward what you need to be trying to accomplish. Um, so yeah, I have a feeling this game is going to be a big hit when it comes out. I think it like fully releases in like five days or something like that. I saw, I, I could be wrong about that, but I, I think it comes out very soon. Um, yeah, this is still technically the, uh, demo here. Which 
which I'm not sure if there's anything, like we got the, a key to this demo sent to us, so I'm not sure if there's anything different about this compared to like what the demo is uh, available on the Steam page, or maybe the demo isn't available on the Steam page, I'm not really 100% sure. Um, damn, I'm getting my ass kicked. I gotta blow up one of these bombs quick. So let's see what happens here. Oh yeah, lucky shot. Take out everybody. Well, not everybody, but a bunch of them. Let's see if I can get a good bank shot going here. Oh, pathetic. Damn it. Yeah, I'm just taking an ass kicking. Goodness gracious. Alright, get that critical going. Give me some... Ah. Could have been better. Could have been worse. Hey, what's going on, Burrito? How you doing? Straight shot at the bomb here. You dropped a bomb on me, baby. Oh, nice. I didn't realize I was using the rubber shot as well. Yeah, same, same. Okay, so let's go for the bomb and the critical. Yeah, yeah. And the refresh. Let's fucking go. That's what I needed. That is for sure what I needed take him out. Yeah, that bomb does 50 damage off the bat. Okay, hopefully. Yeah, let's get a refresh here. Dang, not quite. <laughs> Pursue or pixels or whatever you prefer. My name's also Kevin, so Kevin's fine as well. Um, whatever you feel comfortable with. There we go. That should take care of this enemy for the love of God. Okay. Rubber slime again. Or just rubber orb. Extra bouncy. So the ball itself is extra bouncy. Or upgrades each peg it hits. Okay, let's go with the extra bounce. Or I can heal. You know what? I'm gonna heal. Yeah, I'm gonna heal. Okay. So, looks like I'm going to some kind of boss battle any way I shake it here. So, let's just take the straight shot. I love how you shoot the that final peg. is like a little goblin head. Um, but yeah, okay. Any way I shake it here. Damn, 300? Okay. Let's go. Let's see what happens like this. Eh. Could have been better. Yeah, I'm really digging this game so far. This is just the demo, and I'm pretty sure the game comes out relatively soon, but um, I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, even in, even in demo form, it's already shaping up awesome, which is very promising. And again, I don't want to be, like, reductive, but it's just such a great idea to just be like, okay, let's just add a layer of strategy and, like, roguelike uh, status to, uh, what's it called? To Peggle. Um, kind of a perfect match. Okay, so let's, gotta make sure I hit the critical here. Shit. So let's go for the refresh. Damn it. <laughs> like it's so good oh yeah keep refreshing that board baby
Hopefully after this thing attacks me, it'll get like pushed back or something. <laughs> I really hope. Yeah, otherwise I'm screwed here. Let's let's see. Let's hope for a good bank shot here. Oh, way too much bounce. Or way more than I expected, at least. Fuck. Oof. Oh no, it's just gonna stand right in my face. Until it kills me. Okay. Dang, I was hoping to hit that refresh. This thing's gonna take me down. Oh yeah, I got a feeling. Of course it is. Um. Yep, really nothing I can do about this here. Just watch it all burn. Unless I get just ungodly lucky right here. Oh, wait a sec! 91 damage! More than I thought I'd do, but damn. Oh, Twitch got rid of the desktop app? I didn't even actually know that there was a desktop app, actually, to be honest. Um, okay, so I definitely don't want to try this harder demo. Let's play another run here. I'm into this. Um, very into this. Oh, dang, that map is long, too. Um, but yeah, I, I, anytime I've ever used uh, the Twitch app, it's always on my phone. And then I usually just am on, like... Uh, Again, you guys know how hackney my setup is, uh, Dylan. Like, I've got my Chromebook open over on the side for chat. Um, and then I've got... Uh, oh, there we go. Yeah, get that bomb bright and early. Oh, get two bombs. Let's just call it a wash. There we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, so I don't really need to do much here. Need to do 10 points of damage. Just like watch me not do. Yeah, look at that frog go. God, Cardboard Moon just absolutely killed it on those uh, frog emojis. I'm so... I couldn't be happier with how those turned out. And it was totally, like, on his initiative to just make them. Like, uh, like we collaborated once he started working on them. But he was like, hey, do you mind if I work on, uh, if I mess around with these? And started, like, sending me the coolest stuff. I'm like, oh, my God, these are amazing. Um, just blown away by how cool those are. Um, dang, that's not the bank shot I was looking for. Get that bomb. Okay, looks like those criticals move each time. I don't really know 100% how that works yet. The critical orbs, that is. Hoping to get a bomb off here. Nope. Damn it. I wonder. I wonder if it could be the ad block, Dylan. I'm not 100% sure. Although there shouldn't be any ads running other than, like, when you when like the stream first starts or whatever. I think that's, like, one thing you, like, don't have any control over if you're have if you an affiliate. You, like, have to, at the very least, have that, like, pre-roll ad when somebody jumps on. Again, I kind of don't really know 100% for sure how it works, but that's, like, what I've deduced based on, like, what I can control in the settings. There we go. There we go. I was going to say one more slime to take care of, but they're done. Okay, passes through pegs while traveling upwards with the poltergeist. Okay, that's pretty cool. Um, plus one or plus two for each stone in my deck. Um, let's go with poltergeist. Let's go with... Yeah, this is just wide open. So let's just go this way. I still... I haven't gone to... Well, hopefully if I... Assuming I can win this battle. I was going to say I haven't done... I haven't seen this enemy. Um, but I haven't gone to any question marks yet. So I'm not really sure what... Uh, 
I can get there. Maybe it's like treasure, maybe it's unlockables. But I really have not the slightest clue. Okay, so let's just see what happens. There we go, yes, okay, and if you, once you hit the bomb on the second time and it explodes, it like launches the ball, that's good to know. Target the critical right on the money. Yep. Get a good bounce. Uh, not what I wanted, but I'll take it. Especially. Oh, yeah. Especially if I get that bounce. Let's fucking go. Yeah, I wish you could change who you're aiming at. Although, again, I, I actually. Okay, there we go. Boom. Sliced. Let's go. It's on, baby. Oh, pathetic. Damn it. Okay, this is that poltergeist ball. So... <laughs> that's a cool animation, but I fucking whiffed on the shot. But that's okay. Hit that critical. Ah, oh, come on. Set the board there. I love that animation. Dang it. Alright, one more should do it in. Oh, come on, you piece of shit. Ugh, okay, whatever. And this shenanigans. Yeah, I have. A, I wonder if they're gonna fix some of that stuff. That's sort of the stuff I was saying. Like, I wonder if that's still like the fact that it's like in demo status. Um, Cause yeah, there's like just just some of like the menus are a little chunky or a little janky. Um, it all functions great, but uh, yeah, like even the fact that I'm playing with a controller and it just says like I <laughs> on all these. Um, but let's see, dense, let's see. Can I target any enemy on screen? Okay, that's kind of nice. Two pegs, hits each peg two times, okay. I think I'm actually gonna grab that one, yeah. But yeah, like those, like those question marks just look like so, they could just be a little nicer. Cause that goblin is so cool looking. I love how cute that goblin looks. So like it, May okay, this guess it's just gonna be a regular battle. But it makes it like stand out that it like that those question marks don't look as good, <laughs> you know, as like the enemies and stuff. Even though the enemies are still simplistic, but they just have like a nice you know, they're nice and cute. Let's see. Just a regular stone. Let's just see what happens. Hey, what's going on, Bubbles? Yeah, I'm having a good time with this one so far. And this is just the demo, so I, I, I'm, I'm pretty sure it releases soon, but I'm not 100% sure on that. Should have looked, should have done my due diligence before I started here. Um, but obviously I'm going to have to get to these bombs quick here. Let's get the bank shot going. Twenty fifth, okay, yeah, it's right around the corner. So I'm not sure what they intend to change or if anything, you know, before it comes out. But um, it's definitely got a great uh, gameplay loop so far. Um, yeah, it's like I want that critical, but what I really want are these fucking bombs, baby. Hmm. So let's let's do this. <laughs> well, that sucked. Oh. Nice, wish listed it. Nice, Bubbles. Okay, the poltergeist goes through the balls or the orbs or whatever is when it's on its way up. So that's pretty cool. Okay, 
kill a bunch of enemies. There we go. Oh, nice. And it hits everybody, too. Or at least most everybody. Okay, so hitting this bomb should do the trick. Oh, no, that last enemy is going to have five hit points left. So hopefully the stone or whatever. Oh, the blow dart. One extra. One extra hit. Okay. Let's just put this sucker out of its misery. Okay. Attacks all enemies. Okay, so I kind of like that. this one I don't need to heal just yet so let's do it I keep forgetting that I get the choice to heal after most of these battles and let's go let's go fight some more enemies yeah like I feel like they can really clean this up and make that map look really cool um, that's like a, it seems like a bit of a missed opportunity there if not um, Damn it. Okay. Let's do a little lob shot here. Yes. Torched, baby. Okay. Hit each peg two times. Can target any enemy on the screen. So let's go ahead and target this thing because it can already shoot me from a distance oh yeah and this thing's heavy you can even see in the arc how much heavier it's gonna be damn it oh that was kind of worthless ah i'll take that though Perfect. Get the refresh. Um, I don't think there's any kind of narrative. Again, this is just the demo, so I'm not 100% sure, but it didn't seem like when I started it, it just went like straight into the gameplay, which is my kind of game. <laughs> but I'm sure there's like some kind of at least like reason you're on your mission or something, you know, but, but as it stands, it just went like straight into the gameplay. Um gotta hit that bomb or one of these bombs okay echo okay nice nice uh, I was like hit it again come on beautiful oh nice got another echo hit another critical Yes. Needed that bad. Okay. Back to regular old stone. Dang it. There we go. Double bomb. Yeah, which honestly I prefer, like, sometimes when I play a demo, oh, multi-ball. Like, and it just, like, throws you into a bunch of, like, lore and you're, like, reading a bunch of stuff. It's like, man, I want to just see if I like, like, how the game feels. Because usually I just, like, kind of take a peek at a demo and then, like, okay, I like this. I'll wait for the game to come out. Um, yeah, let's get this ball lightning. Although I'm tempted to heal. But let's get the ball lightning. Yeah. And then let's maybe go try to go for this question mark again. Yeah. But yeah, I'm guessing there's just some kind of general narrative of like, oh, you're just trying to destroy your the goblin. Oh, okay, take a moment to rest or continue on my way. Well, why? Oh, I see. There's going to be a negative downside though. All right, I can fight some fight some punks for. Oh shit! I didn't know it was going to be this punk. Fuck.
Could be worse. Okay. Attacks all enemies. Still trying to figure out with how exactly this echo thing works. Best there. Dang, this thing's gonna take me out again. God damn it. See, there's no bombs for me to work with. tell if like when the ball when this thing is going upwards and it goes through the pegs is it still breaking them it looks like it is okay ball lightning can target any 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 enemy on the screen and then critical attacks the whole column which obviously doesn't come into play in this particular case but oh my god are you fucking kidding me what a joke okay This is not looking, not looking good for me here. Although this dagger can do some serious damage. I mean, it's obviously I'm not going to get the kill here. <laughs> I think I might actually be able to sneak out of here. Depending on the rolls I get. And that's not going to be a good start to things. There we go, there we go, come on! Yeah. Escaped. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, upgrade an orb or heal. I'm gonna have to heal, right? Yeah. Damn it. Oh, but I get a relic. Oh, baby, here we go. Additional criticals. All attacks. Yeah, of course, all attacks plus one. Of course, let's pull up that map. Why don't we go down another question mark road? That was pretty fruitful there. Yeah, plus one, plus one is a no-brainer. I like these little uh, scenes here. Okay. One orb in each hand. Offer the stone, offer the orbsium. Let's offer the stone. Oh, okay. Interesting. Big boss or regular enemies? Let's go regular enemies. Oh, and then we got treasure. Buried treasure. Okay. It's about to make the same Charlotte's Web joke again. Not even joke, just stupid comment. <laughs> uh. oh, man, these things just lay waste to you, though. Okay, so I've got the big heavy out. Oh, yeah, big heavy. Damn, I wish that did damage to everybody. Poltorbgeist. Oh, I didn't even realize that pun was there. Good stuff. Um, let's just see what happens. Alright, let's see what happens for sure. Heck yeah. Kill that dingbat. Oh, kill everybody. Fuck yeah, baby. 
Yeah, totally. Totally, like those Nokia phone games. Let's see, let's see. Target enemy, any enemy on the screen. Whatever, we'll just see what happens again. These spiders don't realize spinning this web makes it nice and easy for me to wipe them out. Yeah, there's like a, there's just a few small missed opportunities that, again, this is still the demo, so maybe it's maybe they're planning on polishing some things up. But there's like just some of the animations seem like a little limited, or like there's like, it, like when the bomb goes off, there's like no sound effect for that, uh, which feels just sort of weird. Um, but yeah, it, it's just little subtle things, uh, nothing that really breaks the bank for me or anything, but. Um, just some things that could like, like, yeah, just, there should be some, like a little victory s little song or something, you know, that to me, that's just like one of the few things that this game is missing. Um, okay. I'm going to have to heal again, right? Or do I get this? Oh, it just looks cool. I want it, but yeah, you know what? Let's get it. going treasure either way if I can make it down there there we go yeah I'm wondering and again this is still the demo so like I know it comes out in just a few days here but like oh oh I thought I had to button mash that for some reason heavy shaft potion also refreshes the board okay don't mind if I do point B of trying to hit the, oh the, I bet you the bombs like do damage to you since you're like just shooting your face at this point I feel like I'm making some headway here let the stone sink yeah oh dang no choice in the matter that's cool. Yeah, we're getting down to the boss here. Let's take a look at the map. Yeah. Just a few more encounters. Although I don't have a ton of health here. So let's see how this shakes out. It always feels good to clear out a bunch of shit on the first shot. Okay. Let's go ahead and hit this critical here, if I can. Damn it. Damn it! Wasted a shot. Especially since that's one that attacks everybody. Fuck. Yeah, those criticals definitely move each time. Okay. Gotta make sure you hit that with a dagger, otherwise it's like pretty dang wimpy and worthless. Ugh. I wish you could like hit the joystick or something to do like a little like uh almost like a like a pinball tilt. I always get the urge to like, ah, oh, just let me nudge. Let me nudge the ball just a smidge. Okay, what does this fireball do now? Lighter than other orbs detonates the bombs in one hit. Okay. So that's what I need. Shit. I'm just gonna have to hope I hit one. I mean, I could obviously try to be a little more accurate, but let's just launch it and see what happens. Hit a bomb. Yes! Yes. That's big. Does that wipe the board? Nope, that red slime's still left. Oh, not anymore, pal. Sit the fuck down. Okay. Orb pierces the first peg. Plus one damage to every orb it hits. I'm gonna heal here. And then we're gonna go to the 
Question mark if possible. Oh, right down the pipe. Perfect shot. I like how these are just like, make a choice. Let's shake the tree. Hey, what do you know? What do the eggs mean? Hmm. Let's embrace the lightning. Ball lightning level two. Let's go. Gotta take your chances and roll the dice sometimes, baby. Oh, it's a big slime. I thought it was gonna be a big walrus for some reason. Yeah, there's some some of the pixel art is really nice. Okay, yeah, the egg heals you for each peg hit. Permanently breaks when hitting anything on the pegboard. What? Okay, so it's just a healing thing one time. Oh, no. Oh, I see. So those slime things. Okay, I see. Oh, weird. So it keeps changing where I can shoot from. Or where I'm shooting from. Like the first shot. Oh, yeah. Hit that bomb. Oh, 720 HP. Yeah, thanks for hanging out, burrito. Have a good rest of your evening, and uh, yeah, Peglin is shaping up to be quite nice. Ooh, it even shows like how it's going to be affected by the slime. Nice. That's cool. Oh, yeah, and those do damage. I didn't think those counted as regular pegs, but they do. Okay, nice. That's part of why I was like, how the hell am I going to do damage to this thing? Okay. I'm going to have to lob shot this thing. Heavy duty. Oh, big critical. Let's go. Suck you into the black hole, baby. Okay. This isn't going to be good because I. Yeah, there's like hardly any criticals around, so I'm going to have to hope I get lucky when I drop through here. Oh, okay, there we go. Might get it. Ah, shit. Yeah, yeah, my, I'm, I'm never on any, like, full, like, schedule with the streams. I just kind of hop on when I'm in the mood to play some games and stuff. So, I, yeah, I never know exactly when I'm going to be hopping on. But, yeah, hopefully we'll uh, catch you around uh, sometime soon. But, yeah, have a good rest of the day slash evening, and we'll catch you then. Oh, damn, okay. Does this mean it's going to do damage to me when I fire this shot off? Fresh the board. Damn, get that critical. Oh no, it's just gonna keep doing damage to me, that's funny. Okay. I don't think there's any way I'm gonna get out of this area. Shit. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Okay. Oh, come on. I'm like, hit that critical. Okay. This I'll take all day. All day, let's go. Let's go. Yes. Okay. Oh, I'm fully healed now, too. Okay, so another Echo Orb. Two blind on hit, so I'm gonna get this thing. Oh, another Relic. A weak magnetic attraction. Every shot has multi-ball. Attack steal two damage. Going magnet. Yeah, that was very close. Oh, the four is complete. Super close call. Oh, whoa. 
new area. Yeah, these maps could use just a little polishing up. Like if it would just add like an another layer of immersion to the game. Um, obviously, it doesn't really affect the gameplay. Oh, got disappearing pegs, um, Mega Man style. Um, you know, it doesn't affect the game itself, but it just you know, it's it's that just that extra layer of. Yep, it doesn't, like I said, it doesn't make or break the game, but it can definitely make a game, like, stand out a lot more. There we go, heavy damage. Man, just suck that fool into that black hole. Okay. This does seem like the perfect kind of game to add. To, I know I said it earlier too, but to add to put to have in roguelike form, basically. Like, I don't know. Oh, that magnet is what's letting me. Oh, let's go! Heck yeah! I forgot that attacks everybody. This music is awesome too. Okay, let's go, Apple Bramble, baby. Okay, I'm actually kind of loving this game right now. There we go. I was in the middle of a thought before, but I forgot what it was. Nothing super important, obviously. Ooh, another Peglin. Haglin. Okay. Free sample. Upgrade an orb. Remove an orb. Hmm. So let's upgrade. Let's upgrade the... Fireball. Or maybe the ball lightning. Yeah, let's upgrade this just to see what it does. Oh, cool. I, like, I love when it shows, like, okay, this is exactly what this upgrade choice is going to do. Cool. And another question mark. 15 damage to all enemies when reloading. Don't mind if I do. Speaking of enemies, let's head that way. Wasn't expecting this run to go deep, and I wasn't, I actually wasn't sure that there were gonna be like different zones. Like I thought maybe that was like part, or that first forest zone was gonna be like the whole demo. So I'm pretty pumped that there's more to this package here. Oh, that magnetic attraction. Let's go. It's amazing. It's almost too good to be true. That's on every ball, too. Not just the ball lightning. Oh, my God. That's, like, almost cheap. But I guess these enemies have, like, a ton of fucking health at this point. There we go. Down the drain. See you later. Oh, that didn't do, uh... How did that not kill that enemy? Dang, that magnet. I don't even really get how that works, but I'm into it. Drop the bomb, drop the poltergeist. Okay, dagger. Gotta get the crit. My best bet's gonna be taking my chances over here. Oh, shit. I'm still in pretty good shape here, though. Found the Bramble, these orbs. Bramble status to the enemy. Unable to move, nice. Oh, nice, that's cool. Heck yeah. This is even better than I anticipated.
I like how the critical peg is just like a trigger, and then it makes like every peg like a critical after that. Um. Yeah, let's go this way. Yeah. How did that not kill this thing? Oh, because it had its shield up. Oh, shit. Okay, I gotta be paying attention to, like, what their attack status is. Yeah. Or maybe I have to attack them to knock the shield down. I think that's actually what is what's happening. an orb or heal, so let's upgrade. I'm gonna upgrade that bramble. And, yeah, let's go ahead down to the bosses. Oh, it even has a little magnet uh, on my, uh, or enemy, not boss, but has a little magnetize on my goblin head ball. Okay. Got some bricks here. This is cool. There's some cool, like, stages, whatever you want to call these. Some cool layouts. Got a nice bomb in there. Took out one of that. Oh, dang, they can jump quite a ways. Keep coming. Yeah, that magnet is crucial. I'd be so screwed right now if I didn't have that. Damn. Crushed. Okay, they don't do too much damage. Thankfully. Okay, critical. Shouldn't be too hard to hit. I was gonna say, if you fucking miss that, I swear to god. Hopefully it hits that enemy in the front. I forgot to switch who I was targeting. Nice. <laughs> oh, can we say the magnet is overpowered? This is amazing. 1200 damage. Let's go. Sit the hell down. Oh, that's amazing. Talk about having a bad day. There we go. Take this sucker out, too. Nice. I feel, like, I feel like the magnet shouldn't, like, full-blown, like, pull the orb upwards. I mean, I'm not complaining. <laughs> but it's, like, it should be a little weaker, maybe. Because, uh, yeah, I feel like I could almost do anything at this point, and I'm good to go. Maybe it's just on this particular stage layout. But it's, like, is this ever even going to end? Like, what if I had that ball that, like, refreshes every, the screen, every, like, five balls it hits, or every, you know, few things it hits. Like, it should, or it should lose its magnetism over time, or something. Um, but, complaints aside, I'll take it. Um, yeah, let's get the mem orb. Add it to my deck. If you will. heavy, get that critical. Nice. Okay, not too much damage. Ah, 
Ah, uh, yes, I keep forgetting that hits everybody. Oh, we've got some healers. Shit, okay. Dang it. That did not work like I hoped it would. That's weird, the magnet doesn't seem to be as overpowered on this particular stage. But maybe it's with like certain types of balls, like yeah, maybe it's this poltergeist ball because it was going up through everything. Yeah. So the combo of this with the magnet is just, man, that's overpowered in the best way. what roguelikes are all about, just overstacking your uh, buffs and everything. Oh my god. God, that is so overpowered. After, like, a certain point, they should have, like, I don't know, some kind of limit on the refresh button. Ah, oh, yes, but I do keep forgetting that goes all the way. So, while I'm at it, I might as well upgrade that orb since it's already overpowered as it is. A little snipe, snipe shot down the middle here. Expose the bomb. Ah, shit. Ah, oh, that'll do. Hit the bombs. Yeah. At least one of them. Oh, two of them. Nice. bomb too, yeah. Don't mind if I do. Hit you with the blow dart. Okay, bonus damage. Every peg that I've hit with any orb so far for the battle. Damn. that you can discard but I feel like I'm more than happy to use it right now but that's an awesome power up and that'll do away with those clowns treasure. Nice. Take a little sip of coffee while I'm on my way over here. What do we got in the chest? Another relic. Pegboard starts with plus three bombs. Let's go. Let's take out a big boss here. We're ready. Oh, shit. It's like mini boss and then right into a right 2,000 health. Holy shit. I mean, obviously we've seen some of the balls I've been tossing around here. So that's not that crazy, but... 
Boom. Bramble your ass. Perfect. Three bombs. Let's go. Okay, so I'm going to discard this one for now. That magnetize. There you go. Another bomb. Another bomb. One more. I think I got three more bombs there. Boom. Oh, dang. Yeah, already halfway away or halfway down on the health. No problem. Yes. Critical fireball. Let's go. Ah, uh, how do you miss that bomb? Come on. Yeah, this wall is no match for me here. That stone could have been better. I'll take the bomb. Yes! Okay, it kind of... I don't know if that was just pure luck or coincidence, but it seemed like it seeked in on that, uh... What's it called? Uh, critical. Alright, let's see if this thing stays overpowered for me. Yes! Right when I need you, baby! Even if you don't do the whole... bit of damage for me, I'll take 250. Shit. Oh yeah, hit the bomb. Yes. That's what I was aiming for. I don't know why I like went for that at the last second, but Okay, this thing's about to destroy me. Yes. Get ah. So close. Oh, <laughs> just slapped in the face. Oh, twice. Oh, it's down to the last, literally the last hit point, so I should have it here. Whew. Close call. This game is sweet. There you go. Okay, I think I got a heal here. As much as I want to upgrade. Immediately deal one damage to the target enemy. Deal two x Uh This might be good for the upcoming boss battle. Heh, <laughs> just that one solo orb trying to block me. Or peg. Oh shit, okay. Take that critical right off the bat. Bombs will do you in. Damn. Ah. Uh, really was hoping for something better there. Okay, fireball. I can hit the critical here, perfect. Give me a bomb, come on. Yeah. Oh, two bombs, nice. Big heavy, ah, shit. Yes. There's the critical. Yeah, that heavy ball is pretty nice with the magnet as well. Really not taking advantage of targeting different enemies. There we 
go. This should do this last enemy in here. Yes. See you later, buddy. See you later. Okay. Upgrade or heal? So let's heal, yeah, because I'm about to be on that final boss here. Ah, shit. Okay, I'll take that. Or final boss of this area, at least. Oh my god. 7,000 health, almost 8,000 health. Holy shit. Not messing around. Dang, I should have targeted one of these minions, though. Yeah, I might have to anyways. I don't know if it'll shoot through the uh, enemies. I don't think I can with this particular shot. Oh, but throw those bombs, baby. Oh, it just took care of both those enemies. Damn, nice. Okay. Okay, the pull torb. I don't know. This is fine. towards the critical, but that's okay. Oh, there we go. Yeah, you can do some hefty damage on these shots. So I guess it's not insane that this thing has like 8,000 HP. Too. It's got a good, really good energy to it. Yeah, this ball is so overpowered with the magnet. Oh my god, yeah. Watch it roll, baby. Might as well sip some more coffee. Yes, 1,500. All right, fireball. What do you got for me? Give me that critical. Come on. Yes. Just watch it roll, baby. I think this thing's gonna get, even get a shot off on me. I don't want to jinx it, but. There's no way. No way this thing's getting a shot off on me. Oh, look at that! Discard this, go for a little echo. A little echo location. Not the best, but not the worst either. I can't tell if, if you hit two criticals, if it like doubles down on like the the multiplier or anything like that. Okay. I think I can do this one even though, yeah, oh God, yeah. I was thinking this, this ball would do the enemy in, but maybe one more. Maybe not. Yeah, definitely at least one more. 300. Shoot. I 
Get that critical, baby. There we go. Oh, this shot will do him in. Bring the walls down, baby. Boom. Yes. Upgrade an orb or skip. How about we upgrade an orb? You know what? I'm going to upgrade that mem orb. Every three pegs hit provides an explosive force. Take one damage for every ten hit, but all attacks deal times two damage. Let's go with this one here. Castle complete, baby. Nice new area, but... I think I'm going to uh, call the str- ah, Maybe I'll keep playing. Maybe I'll keep playing here. What time is it? Five? Yeah. We'll keep playing here. But probably going to wrap it up relatively soon here. Regardless of what uh, happens on this run here. Oh, dang. These enemies are getting quite tough. Is that 777 or is that just question marks? Alright, what's this echo gonna do for me? So many, well, it's good that it does that spread damage, but it's like you basically just need to... There we go, hit that critical. Like, just hit one peg with that, and then, like, every extra peg you hit with that, like, Echo Ball or whatever, is just kind of extra. Uh, yeah. Seems like I can probably just do whatever. Oh, should have been a little more accurate. Okay, the bomb should do it. Oh, is that like opening up like black hole portals on the side? I think it is. Rubber orb. Yeah, let's get that. Hey, hey, what's going on, Terry? How you doing? I'm probably getting pretty close to wrapping things up here, but I'm really enjoying uh, my time with Peglin here so far. Um, which comes out in a couple days here. Um, this is technically the demo. Okay, I have the turtle, orb and relic, uh, contain an additional option to choose from. Sure. Why not? Let's see what's in the treasure chest here. Another relic, all orbs have plus one. Man, I'm getting some good fucking shit every time. I like how the paths on the map like are like crisscrossing at this point. Okay. Skip a bomb. Oh, nice couple bombs. Did I get a second fireball? quick work of this clown. Okay, another Inferno. Or I could heal. Yeah, let's heal. Yeah, just such a such a simple but great idea to just say, hey, let's take Pachinko or Peggle and, and make a roguelike out of it. I've said that like ten times at this point, I know, but broken record. Uh, strange Mirror, remove an orb, remove all orb. What? Remove all orbs? What? Why would I want to do that? I think I'm actually going to get rid of... Might as well get rid of the stone, right? Uh... Bro, 
frozen. Frozen? Hmm. Let's see here. Let's jump back in, return to last save data. What happens here? Oh, weird. Yeah, it definitely froze right there somehow. So, let's try that again. Remove an orb. Oh, maybe because it was not an orb? Huh. Hit every button there is to hit. That's gotta just be a bug there. It's just gotta be. So let's see what happens if I do remove all orbs, I guess. Since I have no other options. Remove all orbs. so confused right now. But apparently I've, I just have one orb left. Like I traded in everything for one mega orb. Better be powerful, that's all I gotta say. Yeah, traded in my whole slot. That's crazy. Oh, and you like start this first shot from like the bottom. But I still have all my relics and stuff, so that's interesting. Obviously, I would. I'm assuming I just hit a bug there, where you know normally you could just pick to remove one orb. Um, although this isn't a bad orb here, to be honest. If you're just gonna have one. Fresh. Let's just hit that on the way up. Oh yeah, it definitely does get just sucked into those black holes. Okay. So you gotta like watch out for the timing on that. Ah, yeah. You really gotta watch out for the timing on that. I don't even know if you have a choice in the matter. Yeah, you definitely don't. They're just pulling on the... Like, pulling the gravity upwards at all times, kind of. That's cool. That's interesting. Like, the way... Because it's, like, especially combined with the magnets, like, pulling towards the pegs, it's pulling towards the top of the screen, but then gravity's pulling it down. Definitely interesting. that bomb uh, so close oh man uh, well I think it was in the cards anyway I love those angel wings that pop up on your uh, little goblin character when you die but yeah I think I'm gonna wrap it up there on that was unfortunate hitting that little tiny bug at the end and yeah there's a few just small things that are like a little rough around the edges like again they I just feel like that map could be so much cooler and so much more immersive but um, other than that, like, I really have no complaints. I'm loving this, like, Donkey Kong Country kind of vibe. Swinging from the treetops vibe to the music here. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to be playing a bunch of this one. Really a big fan of this one. Um, but, yeah, thanks for hanging out, everybody. Um, sorry to pull the plug just when you're jumping in here, Terry. Uh, but we got to record the podcast later this evening. Um, and I got to get all prepped up and ready for that. Make myself some dinner. But, yeah, thanks for hanging, everybody. Um, and definitely check out Peglin if this seems, uh, up your alley. But yeah, thanks again. Take care, everybody, and have a good one.